Hello, good Tuesday morning. Today's Tuesday, December 15th, 2020. 15th means it's 10 more days until Christmas. All right, and today is day 82 of our school year. So I'm going to start with the screen share. Just like yesterday, I'm skipping some of the things where I work on it with you. I want you to try them on your own. I think you can do all right. So I'm going to go straight into what special day it is today. Today is December 15th. And it's the Bill of Rights Day. Now, what are the Bill of Rights? That has something to do with about us being citizens and good citizens. And we have rights and responsibilities. Remember, we kind of learned about that earlier in the year. But the Bill of Rights are the rights we have in the United States. And they've been here ever since the United States was created. And so I have a link right here of a video I would like for you to watch. So please watch this video to learn about the Bill of Rights on today, December 15th, Bill of Rights Day. Now, another thing that I want you to be very watchful for is our journal page has changed just a little bit. What I have found is a website, and I'm going to keep my fingers crossed that it works for you. It's got some neat Christmas prompts. And so I got a Christmas picture and I linked it right here. So let's see how it works when you click on it. Okay. And you have a student login and you need to sign in with Google. And then you'll choose your name. Okay. I'm going to choose mine. It'll look a little bit different from yours, but you should be able to log in. And so here you just type in your name. This access code automatically comes up, and then we'll click enter. And it'll come up like this. And if you'll notice right here is the date 14. This is for the 14th, okay? No, it's supposed to be for the 16th. It didn't make my change on it. But this one is what is for today, okay? Even though it says 14, I tried to put a 16 in there, it wouldn't let me. No, it's supposed to be the 15th. Sorry, I'm looking at my notes. So, it's stuck in a snow globe. It says, color the picture and complete the sentence. Remember to be descriptive. So, you need to trace over. If I were stuck in a snow globe, then you're going to be writing about what would happen. Remember, you need to start with a capital letter in the beginning of sentences. You, I can use spaces between words. And I can use a period to end the sentence. You need to make sure you do that whenever you do sentences. All right. Now, this is, says right here, you come up here and you see page one of five. Okay. I'm not sure if you can print this out. But if you can't, you can either do the text or use the pen, however you want to do it. And if you feel like you'd need more pages to finish this, you're going to skip all the way to page five. It's got all of our prompts for this week, but this is the one for today. But if you go to the last page and you needed more room for it to finish your story, you could do it on this page. And when you're done, you click turn in. Okay? So that's what you're doing for your writing today. And I'll go over these other ones the other days but today you're talking about a story what would you do if you were stuck in a snow globe right about being stuck in a snow globe all right now you could try it you've got if you need to color you could click the pen here's what size it is and you could do this if you want a different color here's the colors to choose from so like let's say i wanted to color this a little bit blue. It's, that one might be too thick. I need to choose a thinner one, don't I? Let's see how much. So if you want to do like that, let's say I want to cover my star in. I would want to probably want to do that. I can do a little thicker and get it colored faster. So try some of those things like that there. I'm doing it real fast, so I'm not doing a good job. All right. So that's what you're doing for your journal today. What if I was stuck in a snow globe? Tell a story about what would happen. All right, I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.